Okay, so you're gonna do a soft reset or factory reset from the menu of your phone, okay? In this case, uh, you are able to access to the main screen using the settings of your phone, uh, nothing blocking the screen or so, something like that. Just You just want to remove Google and register for a new one, okay? So it's very, very important to understand that um, for secu extra security that Google has uh, uh, launched to their Android phones, uh, now uh, it is required for you to re to to register or enter the uh, first email address that you register on your phone when you just barely buy it. In this case, when you buy a brand new phone, activate it on your own. Uh, if you bought a phone on the T-Mobile store or uh, you bought it online or whatever, but you got the phone with a a new box or from the retailer. Um, so that means that the first email is the very first email that you register on this phone. You need to confirm that email address and the, that password in order for you to register another email address. Uh, let's say that you bought this phone from your friend, from your best friend, uh, neighbor, or uh, and they can provide that information if you don't have that, if you don't know it. Okay, so with their email address and password, you can enter and then register your own. That's the way that Google works now. So you you have this phone as a use, a second hand or you found it on the street or uh, and then uh, you don't know or you're not able to uh, find that information it will be impossible to register uh, after you do a soft reset a factor reset from this menu uh, you won't be able to use this phone okay so it's very very important to understand this and I hope that um, I'm sorry for the inconvenience that this may cause. Uh, but if you don't have the information, uh, you won't be able to use the phone. So um, so far, you can maybe if you insert your own SIM card, you are able to make phone calls and uh, text message and everything. But if you go to Google Play uh, or use any Google product, you won't be able to use it, okay? Or you won't be able to um, or keep in your own information on this phone because it is attached to a different account. Okay, so if this is not your case, you just want to remove or delete any everything on your phone, you can go ahead and watch this video on the step that you want to go through. Um, okay, but it's very important to understand also that you need to back up your contacts, back up any um, videos, pictures that uh, is stored in your phone memory. Uh, you can do a backup on your Google account, uh, contacts and everything. So when you do a factor reset on this phone, and you can uh, um, Retrieve all information after you enter, re enter the email address and password on your own. Okay, so um, you know, help on how to back up your information on your Google account. Please uh, look my video, find my video uh, on my channel. I have it as a how to free space using Google Photos or something. And on that application, you can actually um, upload or save everything contacts videos pictures and documents everything okay so if you're ready to go to proceed uh, please uh, just uh, open settings and uh, let's uh, go to the left side I mean right side very end of the right side which is in general and on this section you're gonna scroll okay you're gonna get to this point okay uh, like language and keyboard so when you are in language and keyboard just uh, scroll and um, at the very bottom you're gonna find a backup and backup, backup and reset okay this one alright so now uh, LG backup you can use LG backup 
uh, backup my data is off because so far I don't have any email address stored in this phone so um, if you already um, registered email address previously you have to see the email address here and backup should be on so um, that's Okay, now so just scroll down again and uh, factory data reset. It is uh, the uh, bottom, second from the bottom, and just a uh, factory data reset. Touch that, and uh, this will delete all data information, internal storage like login data, Google and other accounts, system and app data settings, all downloads apps, digital right management license music images documents and backups other user data so like i said um with your google account you can retrieve any application that you downloaded previously or you bought from google play store and now to reset phone just hit the reset option and now delete all data and downloaded apps this gonna be undone so we spoke about uh, backup before and then just hit the option says delete all then uh, your phone will restart twice this may take longer than usual okay so just gonna take a few minutes just hit reset and your phone will power off and on and you're gonna take a few minutes to take you to the main screen uh, to select language register another wi-fi and you can insert your sim card register your google account and so on so this has been a soft reset or also factory reset from the menu of your phone and if you have any password passcode or pattern or crack code blocking the screen of this phone and you're not able to access the settings to uh, reset it um, Please find my video called Heart Reset LG Style 2 Plus. Um, so in that video, uh, we're gonna go through some steps to use the volume down and power key to reset your phone or heart reset or hardware reset. Okay, when you're not able to access the main menu. So uh, please find my video if you need help with that. So please share my video. I hope that I was very clear on this and. Um, enjoy your phone now uh, you're gonna also this system uh, helps a lot to calibrate motherboard in case that you ex you are experienced uh, cold droppings or um, or any other issue on the phone some some phones got stuck on the um, T-Mobile logo or LG logo and you're not able to uh, full power on the phone uh, hard reset helps a lot to calibrate motherboard so uh, any other question on this please let me know in comments I would love to help you with that so right now we are on the main screen and if you need help also how to uh, walk through these steps until you get to the home screen find my video uh, called startup LG style 2 plus family mobile T-Mobile or any GSM carrier. Okay, thanks so much and share my video if this was helpful to you. Thank you.